What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to the very first episode of our Pokemon Yellow walkthrough. And yes, it's me, it's me, it's me, it's GLD. And this is like the seventh take of our very first episode because, well, I can't get things situated. <laughs> but anywho, yes, here we are in our new studio recording this whole thing and editing it. Yeah, yeah, we're editing it. And it's been two months, guys. Two months too long, and I am sorry for the wait, but dang, it, it, it was a uh, it was a big old process that, you know, I have to get into with you guys in the next few episodes about what had happened. But yes, we're finally here. Let me go ahead and press this A button right here, and yeah, well, let's see. Um, first and foremost, guys, I just want to say thank you for all the patience that you guys have, okay? Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for, you know, everything that you guys have done for me right here onto this channel. We went from, uh, you know, 6,000... Staying at 6,000 subs for like two, three years, and making it to 10K uh, within the within one year after COVID and all that credit. And I just want to say thank you guys for all the support. Now, right here, we're restarting because, of course, Draven got himself a new studio. He got himself new equipment. He got himself a new everything. Okay, I'm actually recording this on my new gaming computer. Trust me, guys. When I make restarts like this, that means that we're going to be doing things big. So let's go ahead and play this game. I have quite a few stories to tell you guys about the last two months. And then, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, 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 we'll play this game and all that crap. So let's go ahead and press this button right here. As you can see, we start off with Professor Oak talking to us. Hello there. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are just pets. Others use them for fights. Myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. First, what is your name? Well, you guys already know. It's me. It's me. It's GLD. But we're going to be going Draven for short because, well, you know, that's kind of how I do, do things right there. So let's go press that button right there. Right, so your name is Draven. This is my grandson. He's been your rival since you were a baby. Hmm. What is his name again? And as many of you guys already know, I like to name the uh, the antagonist after the the main character, one of the main characters in the anime. Well, Gary for you know the antagonist right there, because we already know Gary is a you know what. So let's go ahead and press that. That's right. I remember now. His name is Gary. Draven, your very own legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. Well, would you look at that. So how'd you guys like the new sidebars or background? I don't know. I still haven't gotten used to this whole thing right here. Anywho, guys, welcome back to Pokemon Yellow. And yes, we are going to do things a lot more differently right here. Now, for the first story that I need to tell you guys is the background. Uh, at first, I wanted to make this whole thing informational like in my Pokemon, my original Yellow version. As you guys already know... Did the whole informational thing. Kind of got lazy towards the very end because I kind of wanted to start Pokemon Crystal and all that crud. And, uh, yeah. Kind of left a sour taste in my mouth, but I still wanted to do Pokemon Crystal and whatnot. Um, but then, you know, when I when I got down to the whole nitty-gritty part where, like, okay, we're going to do everything informational. We're going to do this. We're going to do that. I went against it real quickly because it went against the whole thing that I made this channel off to be make it simple make it good make it quality but make it simple guys and me being informational as you know what I'm yeah that, that, that was a little too much work plus I don't have I don't have that much time to actually be doing so much work for my channel and all that stuff so make it basic now the other thing too was I kind of wanted to make it you know um, where you guys could see me on the on the camera but then you know obviously over in my room or in my studio right here, yeah, everybody turned the light on and off. The switch is outside my door. Seriously. How did how, how does that happen? So yeah, that was that. And then, well, there was the little thing with, you know, having a GIF as a Pokemon on the side. And that didn't necessarily work out to the best. But, you know what, it, it is what it is. That's the first story right there, guys. It was a... <laughs> It was a, a huge thing, and on top of that, yes, this is the seventh take of my very first episode right here because, well, you know, I, I want to make things perfect for all you guys, and hopefully this episode right here will be perfect enough for you guys to actually get things done. So, as you can see, 
We are in Pallet Town, and what it says right here on the sign, it's the Pallet Town. Shades of your journey await. And, well, let's go straight to the uh, professor's lab and see where uh, the, the old, good old professor's at. And, well, we have Gary right here, and he's like, Yo, Draven! Gramps isn't around. I ran here because he said he had a Pokemon for me. Hmm, okay, well, he's not here. Let's go right ahead and find that man. I wonder where he could be. I'm pretty sure it's at the grass, right? Let's go straight to the grass. Now, we've taken quite a few steps here, and there's Professor Oak, and he's like, That was close! Wild Pokemon live in the tall grass. And just like that, bam. We are getting a Pokemon, and it happens to be Pikachu, the only one in the whole world right here. And, well, Professor Oak showing us his skills. Yes, he's throwing that ball, and bam. That's right. This is why he's a G, because he can capture a Pokemon in the whim, like in the whim right there. Whew! A Pokemon can appear anytime in a tall grass. You need your own Pokemon for protection. I know. Here, let's come to the uh, professor's lab for me. Or whatever. Again, still can't speak, guys. I'm, a little, I'm very excited for what's going on right here, guys. Uh, I hope you like the new intro, outro, and all that crud. It's just, you know, <laughs> we changed a lot, guys. So, anywho, Gary's like, Gramps, I'm fed up with waiting. Hmm, Gary, why, why are you here? Hmm, I said for you to come back later. Ah, whatever, just go, just wait there. Look, Draven, do you see that ball on the table? It's called a Pokeball. It holds a Pokemon inside. You may have it. Go on, take it. Gary's like, hey, Gramps, what about me? Be patient, Gary. I'll give you a Pokemon, or I'll give you one later. Okay, well, he prefers us rather than his own, uh, you know, grandson. So let's go right ahead and grab this Pokeball right here. But unfortunately... This happens. We get pushed out of the way, and Gary's like, No way, Draven. I want this Pokemon. And just like that, we get a Pokemon snatched from us. Gary, what are you doing? Gramps, I want this one. But, uh, I, oh, all right then. That Pokemon is yours. I was going to give you one anyway. Draven, come on over here. Okay, well, I'm still flipping you off, Gary. Anywho, Professor Oak's like, Draven, this is a Pokemon that I caught earlier. You can have it. I caught it in the wild and it's not tame yet. And just like that, we get ourselves a Pikachu. And, well, as many of you guys already know, in the last walkthrough, you guys have seen that I have nicknamed my Pokemon uh, Sparky. Now, had I known that, you know, what would happen ahead in uh, the rest of my other walkthroughs, I would probably name it, nickname it a little bit differently. And since, well, my, my niece kind of knew that I was going to restart and all that stuff, yeah. She kind of made a little threat right there, so... <laughs> I'm sorry, Sparky, we can't nickname you. Or, sorry, Pikachu, can't nickname you Sparky. Uh, yes, we are going to be nicknaming this Pikachu after someone close to my heart. Yes, my baby girl, my niece, Aaliyah. So, I guess we're going to have to refer to this Pikachu as a, as a she, probably. I don't know, before gender came out. I don't know, but there it is, guys. Say hello to Aaliyah, the Pikachu, named after my niece herself. So, let's go ahead and take a look at this Pikachu. So as you can see, Pikachu, pure electric type Pokemon, huge disadvantage at the very beginning of this game. It's attack, it's speed, it's special, it's alright, it's defense, not the best. Trust me guys, it's not the best, and well, there's it's only two attacks right now, so you guys already know what's next. You guys have already seen what happened in my very first uh, episode, in the original Pokemon Yellow, so let's go ahead and get over this. Okay, so we were trying to walk away, and Gary's like, wait, Draven, let's check out our Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you on. Oh, crap, Baskets. Here we go. Okay, guys, so here it is. We are taking on our rival, Gary, and he is coming out with the Pokemon we should have gotten, Eevee. And here comes Aaliyah. So, as you guys remember, we lost to Gary in the very first episode of our original Pokemon Yellow. Now... Battling Gary right here and at Route 22 will dictate its evolution, the Eevee's evolution, I should say. Now, if you beat Gary right here and at Route 22, you will get a Jolteon at the very end. If you lose right here like I did in my first one and beat him at Route 22, you'll get a Flareon. Now, if you beat him here, lose or skip Route 22, you will actually get a Vaporeon. But you guys already know me. I, I you know, I want the smoke. I do not like losing. And, uh, well, just like that, uh... Eevee is a little stronger than us. Just a little bit stronger. And, uh, yeah, its tackle attacks are really messing me up right now. So, here we go again. 
Thunderstruck nearly beats this guy. And here's an opening that we need. Thundershock for the win. Eat it, Eevee. <laughs> Can't speak. Can't speak, guys. And there it is. We learned Tail Whip. What now? Okay, so there it is, guys. One piece to the puzzle. And yes, of course, Gary's going to be complaining about choosing the wrong Pokemon. But as you can see, okay, I'll make my Pokemon fight to toughen it up. Draven, Gramps, smell you later. Flipping you off, buddy. Flipping you off. Hey. And, oh, wow, oh, I forgot about this. What? Would you look at that? It's odd, but it appears that your Pikachu dislikes the Pokeballs. You should just keep it with you. That should make it happy. You should, you can talk to it and see how it uh, feels about you. Hmm, let's see how it, how my Pikachu feels about me right now. Let's see. And just like my 10 year old niece, that's the same face she makes me uh, each time I come to visit. I don't know why. They grow up so fast. Anywho, we would stop right here, but no, we're gonna we're gonna do a full episode, and uh, yeah, you're gonna hear me talk just a little bit, okay? So, anywho, guys, uh, now with the background right here, yeah, you're gonna you get you get into sprites and all the Pokemon. Talk to this guy, you'll get yourself another potion. Yeah, you're gonna get sprites. You're gonna get you know what was it called? Uh, you're gonna get yourself some badges and all that stuff. But that wasn't always the case about you know how I was gonna go about this whole walkthrough too. Um, shoot, I wanted to make uh, GIF animations part of this whole, this whole uh, background here, but then I realized that, they, yeah, it was, a, it was more work than what it needed to be, especially when I didn't know what Pokemon I was going to get. So here we are in Viridian City, and well, you're trying to pass by here, this guy's like, you can't go through here, this is private property. Hmm, somebody didn't have its drink, huh? Okay. Now... I know that some of you guys were questioning about what Pokemon team I was going to get. Is it going to be the same team like like before? Is it going to be with new Pokemon? And, well, look at that potion. Uh, I can tell you this. There's going to be maybe one or two, maybe three Pokemon that are going to be the same on this team. But there are going to be some other Pokemon that I will be using. That I, well, I'll be using for the first time. Now, the other thing, too, here is, guys, that I kind of want to make this this adventure all the way up to the next few generations something very memorable every Pokemon that I capture they're gonna be moving with me from version to version to version now I get it some of these Pokemon you have to hack in the different games but trust me I'm not gonna over level them uh, I'm not gonna over level them in the next in the next series or anything I'm just gonna keep them just like just like they were at the very end and on top of that it's gonna be like a like Ash Ketchum's adventure. He just puts him in a PC. He moves on. Unfortunately, we don't get the benefit of taking Pikachu right here. Now, the other thing too is, I need it. I want to take a. I actually want to use more native Pokemon than anything. So, you guys are going to be seeing a whole new, you know, a whole new method to this whole madness right here about me using Pokemon teams. I will be using a lot of native Pokemon from version to version to version with the, ex, you know, with the. Ex, I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying, but yes, we are going to be using native Pokemon from here on end. And well, once you go into the Pokemart right here, here's a convenience store clerk. He's like, hey, you came from Palatown. You know Professor Oak, right? His order came in. Will you take it to him? And look at that. We get ourselves the Oaks Parcel, which is great. Fantastic. And well, talk to him again. Okay, say hi to him for me. All right. Whatever you say, homeboy. All righty. So let's move on ahead right here. And well, let's see. What 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 is happening right here? Okay, so we can't buy potions, we can't buy Pokeballs right now. So what we need to do is we need to get back home and uh, you know, be the delivery boy. So yes, guys, native Pokemon are gonna be used in the next few walkthroughs. I mean, I, the last time I've used native Pokemon only was in Pokemon Black, and that was when you know they kind they kind of wanted to fix that whole uh, that, that whole thing up. And look at that, we're gonna be battling a wild Pokemon. So while I'm talking, like while I'm battling, I'm gonna be talking about this. So yeah, that, that's that's what I'm going to be doing from here on in. Now, there are gonna be some Pokemon that I've used before. They're gonna still be here. They're gonna have a spot in my team uh, elsewhere, guys. Yes, the remakes are gonna be redone too. Again, I have a lot of plans for my channel. Lots and lots of plans. And I get that I'm starting over, guys, but that's the best thing about starting over. It's just how you, how, how much better you can do and trust me you guys already know me 
I like to restart because I want to challenge myself and I want to make things a lot more better on my channel. And I just want to bring some high quality content for you guys. So here we are in Professor Oak's lab and he's like, Oh, Draven, how's my old Pokemon? Well, it seems to like you a lot. You, you, you must be talented as a Pokemon trainer. We only had one wild Pokemon battle. How am I talented? What? You have something for me? And yes, we have delivered the Oaks Parcel to this old man, and he's like, Ah, this is the custom Pokeball I ordered. Thanks, Draven. By the way, I must ask you to do something for me. And speak of the devil, we got this guy right here, Gary. He's like, Gramps! Gramps, my Pokemon has grown stronger. Check it out! Ah, Gary, good timing. I needed to ask you both uh, to do something for me. On this desk right here is my adventure, the Pokedex. It automatically records data on the Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Draven and Gary, take this with you. And look at that, we get ourselves Pokedexes. This is great. To make the complete guide of all Pokemon in the world, oh yes, that is my dream. But I'm too old! I can't do it. So, I want you two to fulfill uh, my dream for me. Get moving, you two! This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. Alright, Grams, leave it all up to me. Draven, I hate to say it, but I don't need you. I know, I'll borrow a town map from my sis. I'll let her le let her not, or I'll tell her not to lend you, lend you one, Draven. <laughs> flipping you off, man, I'm flipping you off. Okay, so, um, let's go right ahead and see if she will actually give us a, uh, a town map, okay? Like, see how much she doesn't want us to succeed. So here's Daisy, and she's gonna be like, Grandpa asked you to run an errand? Here, this will help you. And bam, we got ourselves a town map. Told you she doesn't hate them, or she doesn't like them. Anywho, guys, yes, this was the first episode ever. Oh my god. In the next episode, we're gonna be battling Gary once again, capturing some Pokemon, and going through the Viridian Forest. We're gonna be having a lot of fun, guys, trust me. Um, again, thank you guys for all the patience in the world. Um, it means a lot to me. It means a lot that, you know, you guys are sticking by me, especially through this new restart. And I hope that, you know, the, the, the high quality content that I'm bringing here will have you stay and, you know, share my stuff. Uh, since I've reached 10k subscribers, now I can get donations and all that stuff. So if you guys want to donate to this channel to make it a little bit better, the link's down below right there. Um, anything else? Yes, subscribe, hit the, you know... Hit the bell notifications if you want to get some stuff. From here on in, guys, we're going to be getting a lot of walkthroughs. We're going to finish this epi or finish this walkthrough and the next ones uh, real quick. But they're going to be quality content. So, again, thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you. And, uh, well, I'll see you in the next episode when we uh, do some uh, other stuff right here. Like Beat Gary. See you guys.